What's going on everyone? Chase with Shinify here and today we're going to be talking about the fastest and easiest way to make over a thousand dollars a day with AI and ChatGPT. Now this is part three of a series that I've been building for you, which is within a free checklist I'm going to be giving you at the end of this video along with a thousand dollar giveaway that you can enter that we do every single week. And I'm also going to be giving you a free checklist of tools and all kinds of other cool stuff. If you just stay till the end of this video, I'll show you how to get all of this. But if you want me to keep you updated as well with all of the things that I'm doing with AI, all the tests that I'm running, this step-by-step -step series, let me know. Respond with the word yes in the comments right now. It lets me know to make more videos like this for you. And it also just helps the video get more reach. So please go ahead and respond with the word yes if you have a second to do that and we will get started right now. So let me just recap really quickly what we covered in part one and part two. So inside part one, I show you how to use an AI video generator to go and create content that you can post on places like Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, and more. And these videos get tons of views and tons of leads. In part two, I showed you how to go and schedule all this content out with an app called Radar. Now, in part three, I'm gonna be showing you how to go and respond to all of the comments and leads you get with AI. And for that, we're gonna be using another app, which I will leave as a link in the description of this video. There is a free trial inside the link if you go to the link. And the tool we're gonna to be covering is called ManyChat. So let's go ahead over to that tool and we will get started with the free trial. So I'm gonna go open up this tool in my private browser. And again, if you go through the link, it's gonna say get started for free. You're gonna click on that. And then you're gonna connect your account. Now I recommend you just focus on Facebook Messenger to start and then Instagram. What we're gonna be doing is as we start scheduling out our content with these schedulers we're going to be posting to instagram facebook pages youtube TikTok, so on and so on but the main platforms that we're going to be automating our engagement on are instagram and facebook and the reason why we're not going to be doing it on the other platforms is because this tool really only supports these two platforms now there are other are other tools that i've seen that will go and do this for other platforms like youtube and TikTok, but we're not going to cover those in this video so let's just talk about these ones to get started. So ideally, once you follow the step-by-step -step instructions I showed you in part one and part two, you should have some videos, you should have a Facebook page, you should have an Instagram, and they should be connected inside of Radar. And what's gonna happen is, as you start posting content, you're going to get people asking you questions. They're gonna say, hey, how do I get started with this? You know, what's the, what's the website? that I need to go to, like anything that you put as a call to action inside of your video, which I always tell people to respond with the word yes, you're gonna get people to go and engage and you're going to use robots to automatically respond to them. You can see it says, hey, it's Chase with Shinify, sent you a DM. And then if I click on their profile and I look at the message between them and I, and I guess I can't do this on the desktop app, but you'll see that I did send them a DM with a robot and I send out tons and tons of DMs every single day just using this tool. And I'm not, I'm not actually going in here and doing this. The robot does it all for me. Okay. And this works again, not just on Instagram, but on Facebook pages as well. So the way we do that is we go to the tool, we connect to Facebook messenger to start, click on continue. It's going to have a sign into Facebook. And then once we're signed in, it's going to look like this. Let me sign into my actual account here. So you can see I have a few different pages connected. Um, I actually have more than this connected. It's just on a separate ManyChat account. This is something we're actually migrating over right now. But you can see my main account, ShineRanker. I have all of these live chats in here. So I have Instagram and Facebook. So these are all the different messages coming through. So the idea here is that I wanna set up an automation. So if I go to automation inside of ManyChat, you can see I have these few different automations. Now I'm gonna show you the ones I use. You don't need a bunch of them and you really just need them to be pretty simple, okay? So the way you set up an automation is you click on new automation. You're going to start with a uh, blank template or start from scratch up here on the top right. 
and then it's going to ask you for a trigger. Now you can go crazy with this, right? You could go and make, I've seen people make like 20 day sequences. You don't need to do that to start. You just need a basic trigger where you're, when somebody comments or when somebody sends you a message or when somebody interacts with you, you can send them your opt-in or your offer. So let's click on new trigger. We're going to make the most basic one that you should have, which is on Instagram and Facebook. These are the really the only two that you need. So if they comment on your post or they, um, if they comment on your post on Facebook or they comment on your post on Instagram, we want to message them, right? So let's say they comment on our post on Facebook. Um, you can see here it says specific post. We actually want to use any post. Now, if you want to have this trigger on any post you do, you do need to get the pro version. I think it's like 15 bucks a month, but it's totally worth it. Um, if you just want to experiment with the tool and not have it be on any post, then you would click on specific post and then you would select one of your posts from Facebook just to try it out. But either way, uh, we're going to go any post and then it says comment contains any word. So I, I could make it say, you know, anybody that says the word yes, but I'm just going to do, you know, any word. So anytime somebody says anything on one of my posts, I'm going to send them a link to one of my offers. Now you can see it says track first level comments only. So that means instead of it going in, you know, if somebody responds to somebody's comment, if I leave this off, it'll send them a link as well, but I'm just going to do only the first level comments and then public auto response and feed. That means I'm going to comment on their comment and I'm going to say, Hey, I sent you a DM. Okay. You can also choose to like their comment afterwards, but if I click on save here, now you can see this is the trigger that should be working. And all I have to do is do the action once the trigger happens. So then I'm going to click on messenger. I'm going to say send within 24 hour window. And I'm going to say, Hey, here's the link. Okay. Now remember in our videos that we generate with Shinify or any, any sort of video that we're going to be posting, I recommend that in your script, you tell them, Hey, respond with the word. Yes. Respond with the word. Yes. For this thing. Now this thing could be anything, right? So like, for example, in our videos, we're saying, here's the top websites, you know, shinify.com, this other website. And at the end, we always say, respond with the word. Yes. If you'd like what, whatever the call to action is, right? So if you'd like the checklist, if you'd like the free course, if you'd like our free giveaway. So right here, it says, if you want me to show you how to use this website to make money online, reply with the word. Yes. Okay. So you can do that at the end of every single one of your videos. And that's how you're going to get a lot of leads, right? Cause all these people saying, yes, you're going to get them as leads. Not only that, but when they respond with the word, yes, you're also going to create engagement, which means your videos are usually going to get more views. Now you'll see like some of these account or some of these posts don't get that many views. Like this one got only 1500, this one got only 1600 or thousand. And the idea though, is that if you watch part one and part two, you'll know that we're not just posting to one page, right? So let's say one page gets a thousand views per post. Well, if we have 30 different pages, that's 30 times a thousand. And some of our posts get like 10, 20, 30,000 views, even more. And so on average, every single post we make gets us around 50 to hundred thousand views just because we're distributing our content to all these different places. And then on top of that, with the amount of leads we get, right? Let's say we get, uh, I don't know, a hundred leads per thousand views, you know, we're getting thousands and thousands of leads just from one of these videos by using this automation. And so, yeah, it takes a little bit of time to create all the pages, you know, create all the content, load it up and then create your, you know, sequences here. But once you have it going, it's just a way to get thousands and thousands of leads without you having really to do that much. Okay. So here's the link. Um, this can be to whatever you want. I'd recommend sending them to like an affiliate offer. Um, for example, if you go into the checklist, I'm going to be giving you in a second, uh, you can promote any one of these tools and get paid to promote them. You can also promote our giveaways. Um, and then in the, one of our future trainings as well, I'll also show you how to make your own opt-in because um, if you want to start building your own email list, which you'll probably want to do at some point, then I would recommend that you stay tuned for the next 
video where I'll be showing you how to go and start managing your leads as well. But for the moment, I would just put some sort of affiliate link. So let's say you got an affiliate link to Shinify um, by going to the website, scrolling down, going to the dollar trial, and then putting forward slash partner at the end. Now you can sign in, grab an affiliate link, and then if I were you, I would just promote something like the free giveaway or something that they can get for free um, or the dollar trial if you wanted. And that's what you can put as your response. So, hey, here's the link. And then I can put the link. Let's just say it's shinify.com forward slash your URL. Boom. And then I can click on set live. Okay. Now, if I go back, you can see it says untitled. I'm not going to publish it again because I already am using this um, automation. And I can show you what it looks like. You can see here it says Facebook comments. We had 17,000 runs. That means 17,000 comments in, since one week ago. Uh, and this is just on this one page. 58% uh, conversion. And then I can see this is what they're saying. Uh, this, is, this is basically the stats. So 11,000 sent, uh, 8,000 delivered, 8,000 open, and then we got 6,465 people clicked. So, um, by the way, I always put a button here too, because some people say that, oh, I can't click on the link. I don't know why. Um, so whenever I send the response, I usually also click on add button, open website, and then I say click here, and then I put the website there, even though I linked it there as well. Okay. And you can see I'm, I'm sending people to the free giveaway. Um, and then I also, what I do after that, when they click there, I also have them opt in to our updates because if they opt into updates, um, on your messenger list, it also allows you to send messages to them outside the 24 hour window. So if I go to broadcasting here, I can start sending broadcasts. For example, I'm going to send out this video in a second to 3000 people and say, Hey, I just made a video. You should go watch it. Okay. Um, so the way you add the, uh, opt-in for that pretty simple. You, whenever they click on the button that we talked about a second ago, uh, you change the message, the action to messenger, and then you just do messenger list. Okay. All right. And then you can copy all the stuff, by the way, I have in here, just pause the video, you know, copy all this, and then you can change out the link with your link. I um, mean, you can essentially have the exact same funnel. So that's the Facebook opt-in for the Instagram opt-in, pretty much the same thing. Let me go in here. If user comments on a reel, any comment, I'm going to say, Hey, it's chase. I sent you a DM. I'm actually going to remove part of that just because I don't think it's necessary to say that they can also find it in my bio. Cause if I'm going to be sending them a link, then they should be able to just go to the link in the message. And I'm not sure why it's not letting me, Oh, here we go. Boom. Let's just edit that. Okay. And then um, what I can do from there is I can send them to the call to action, right? So, hey, here's the link to the free AI checklist along with the giveaway. Now, here's the thing about um, Instagram. You can't do uh, Instagram broadcasts. You can only do many chat broadcasts. So you can't really have them subscribe to like updates or anything after they click on this button with Instagram. So just know if you're trying to do that with Instagram, it's not going to work. It's only going to work with many chat. And then you can set up a few other ones, right? So if they send you a DM, um, and let's say it contains certain words like yes, how I'm interested, so on and so on. See if message contains, yes, interested, Hey, hi, hello. Um, then you can send them a link and then you can make another automation where if they respond to one of your stories, um, but again, all of this is inside of the, like, I know I'm clicking around a lot here, so sorry if I'm confusing you, but, um, all of this is inside when you build an automation. So, um, a lot of it's actually, uh, recommended to you when you go into the new automation. But if I just do start from scratch, I just click on new trigger, whether it's messenger or Instagram, and it'll show me all the different actions, right? So if I want to, you know. Uh, if somebody clicks on an Instagram ad, if somebody co comments on my post, if somebody replies to my story, if somebody clicks on a link, if somebody sends me a message, if somebody comments on a live, 
right? Same thing with Messenger. If somebody comments on a post, somebody DMs me, if somebody scans a QR code. So you could set up all of these if you wanted to. I think it's a little overkill because honestly, like I said earlier, really the biggest one is just if somebody comments on your post, okay? So then once you have that going, now what's gonna happen is now that they're live, anybody that comments on, let's say a Facebook post on your page or on you know your uh, Instagram pay posts, you're gonna have your bots go and start sending them all your links. And this is really, really important because otherwise you're gonna to have to go and manually respond to all these comments, right? So like, you look at this, all of these comments in here, um, my bots responding and sending them a message. So let me click on see response here. You can see it on Facebook. I guess you can't see it on Instagram, but here's all the responses coming in. And the UI on Facebook's a little wonky. I'm not sure why it's not showing this here. Um, but it definitely is sending the messages. And so, so let's just quickly recap what we've covered here. So step one, we have generated AI videos with something like Shinify. We're scheduling them out now with Radar, and then we're responding to them with ManyChat. So pretty straightforward in the process, right? Because all of this should be pretty automated, making the videos, scheduling them out and getting them responded to. Now in the next part of this series, I'm going to show you how you can actually start following up on the back end because up until this point, all of this has been on the front end. So making the video, scheduling, responding to, that's all front end stuff. We also need to talk about how to actually monetize this on the back end, and that's what we're gonna be covering next. So again, if you wanna see part four of the series, make sure you respond with the word yes in the comments. And to get the giveaway, all you have to do is go to the AIgiveaway.com, um, follow the instructions here. It's pretty simple. You just follow me on different platforms, send a text, there's different ways to enter, and then go grab the free course and the tools and everything. And we'll see you in the next one. Till we do, happy money making. Thanks for stopping by.